Hi everyone, I'm meteorologist Sam Ryan. Zeta made landfall yesterday at uh, Category 2 just outside of Louisiana with 110 mile per hour maximum sustained winds and then moved over New Orleans and then eventually uh, into Mississippi and is now traveling up here to the northeast very quickly. Has uh, been downgraded to a tropical storm, but we had a number of reports. There's reports of uh, around a million people without power now in the southeast due to Tropical Storm Zeta, which again continues to lift up here to the northeast. It's racing, moving very, very quickly. Here's the latest. It's moving to the northeast at roughly 40 miles per hour. And by Thursday, around 1 p.m. midday, we'll be into Virginia and then heading out to sea, moving into South Jersey. Here's the tropical storm warnings where we have wind gusts in excess of 50 miles per hour in many locales. But we'll see those winds again kind of pulsating between about 30 to 50 miles per hour and a slight chance of an isolated tornado, just a 2% chance that stretches all the way into South Carolina and the southern portion of North Carolina. Rainfall amounts could be heavy in certain spots and as we zoom on out, even heavy up here towards the Ohio River Valley. Could see anywhere from 3 to 4 inches of rainfall. Here's a look at the national map. All those warnings, watches and warnings down to the southeast. High temperatures, meanwhile, a little cooler up to the north. 58 in Seattle, nice and dry and pleasant over in the southwest. And then 87 in Miami with that rain moving into the northeast.